Hello guys, and welcome back to another episode on Half-Life Opposing Force. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode. Last episode, what we have done is we have gone and we have, um, well, attempted to escape from Black Mesa. Our um, military allies were already there waiting, the helicopter was ready. All you have to do is just enter the chopper and leave. But unfortunately, we were abandoned and are now considered missing in action. The G-Man came along, he closed the door in front of us and made us watch as the helicopter, in other words, our last hope of escape, flew away and abandoned us at the facility. And now, we are trapped alone in Black Mesa with nothing but, well, a bunch of guns to defend myself with. We also completed the uh, chapter 3, we are pulling out chapter, and we have begun, well technically missing in action is chapter 3, because incoming is a cutscene, welcome to Black Mesa is the first chapter, we are pulling out a second one, so now we're technically on chapter 3, missing in action. So let's go, let's load right in, and let's get right back to it, where we finished off in the last episode. And today we're gonna go and, well, keep on progressing for the Black Mesa facility, keep on attempting to find an alternative method of escape. In the base Half-Life game, the way you escape from uh, Black Mesa is by going to Zen and killing Neolith. That's where the game ends, the G-Man teleports you away. The way that you escape Black Mesa in Blue Shift is you use the teleporters and teleport yourself outside of the main gate, and that's where you, you know, you and your scientist friends find a car, hotwire it, and escape. But how do you escape in this game? I don't know. Let's find out. At the end of last episode, you have found this area and killed all the enemies here, plus you also found ourselves an RPG, which is quite cool. And you also encountered these new enemies. These are brand new enemies. They were not in Blue Shift or Opposing, not Opposing Force, Blue Shift or the base game. So these are brand new enemies. They are only in Opposing Force, from what I know. And I gotta say, they look... God almighty, they look terrifying. They have like two little hand things. They spit these spikes at you from their mouth. They have eyes, they have spikes on their back legs. They're absolutely terrifying. And yeah, that's quite a few of them that we killed. We came from this direction right here. This was the, um, whatever this area was up here. Yeah, of course, yeah, we came from here. This is, yeah, this is this dead guy. There's a different area over there. There's a whole like a sewer type of thing area. And then we came from here. That was locked, so we had to go down here. And so we did go down here into storage area too, and here this is where we counted those new enemies, we killed them. And now you have two ways you can go. You can either go that direction, where there's more of those weird animal thing magic that you're gonna kill, or alternatively, we can go over there towards the service elevator through that door over there. So, uh, I don't know, I think we're gonna go to the service elevator first, then I'm gonna try to go right through there. What's in here? Oh, there's more of those things. Gold mine, of course, there's more of them. And they have noticed me. Oh, yeah, right, come on. How much health do you have? Golden, but look at them, the way they walk. Jesus Christ, they're goddamn terrifying. Anyway, what other weapons do I have? I also have the shotgun that I can use against these guys. Come here, you fiend. Oh, this is gonna be so broken. Yo! <laughs> look at the sign, it's actually alive. I don't know what's worse. You soldiers under orders to silence the facility of all these vile aliens. <laughs> yeah, to be honest, that's a fair point. Because that's the reason we're here. The soldiers were, you know, sent here to silence everybody here and kill them. So he doesn't know what's worse. These things, or us. Yeah, hmm. I don't know, man. Both are equally bad. So, oh god almighty, Jesus Christ. That scared the hell out of me. Alright, so you can either go through here to this elevator shaft. Which is, um, very broken, very falling apart. But you can go through here. But it's still the other way, so I have to probably go there first and check that out, don't we? Yeah. So we save the game. Then I'm gonna go and journal myself off. Yep, I'm dead, believe it or not. Oh, look, there's my skull. I'm gonna load back in, turn it around, shoot his gun ahead. There we are. And we're gonna jump out right here, once again. And now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go and speak with this guy that I just shot. Yo. Fine. You won't even know I'm here. So we can actually make him follow me, but. Yeah. I don't know what we're actually supposed to do. <laughs> I don't know what we're actually supposed to do with these guys. I yeah, I don't know what we're supposed to do with these scientists. Like, are we supposed to kill them? I mean, that is why we're here. Our orders are to kill the scientists. So technically, I should put a bullet in this guy's brain, but... I mean, why should I? It's not gonna benefit me in any way. I mean, my, you know, Imperial... Not Imperial. Wrong, wrong, you know, trilogy. My, uh, soldier friends have left me here. So why should I follow their orders? I mean, killing this guy will not give me anything. Plus, it's a waste of a bullet to put into him. So, yeah. Alright, mate. You can be spurred. You can just vibe. You have saved your life. And, uh, in return... All I want is, um, 
Nothing really. You can just stand there and yeah, perform random actions. While well, I try to go and look the other way and see what's. Oh, I'm stuck, almighty. And go for here and see what's inside of here. Because the other directions. I think we're supposed to go in the other direction. Oh, oh god, they're spitting at me. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ, pay attention. But I think we're supposed to go. Hold on, pause the game. We're supposed to go right through the area that I just showed you. And this area is pretty just a bonus area of bonus loot. I'd guess, yeah. Anyway, where are you? Here we go. Ah, go on, Maddie. There we are. It's dead, there we are. There's more, of course, there's more, there's always more. Come here, you son of a gun. There we are. And as you can see, there's nothing here like I thought. So this is just like an empty area. And then the other area is where we are supposed to go. Makes sense. Other than this guy's dead, but he has some health, so yeah. My poor guy. What's through here? God knows. Can't really find out. I can kind of look through. We're going further back, but I mean, I'm still... Yeah, so it doesn't give me much visibility. Well, we're just going to go and hope that there's nothing interesting back there, because we're not getting through. Not our way. Oh, look, shield. Nice. I don't know, grab all of you, and we keep on going. There we are. But yeah, this bozo's dead. Unfortunately for him, I destroyed his body. <laughs> it's just his skull left. Well, whoop. Actually, I didn't really want to kill his body, to be honest. To kill his body, that makes no sense. Yeah, oh, and I have to go through here again. God damn it. Yeah, okay. Cool. You exist. Everybody knows about you. Yeah, okay. Stop. Oh my god. Yeah, come on. Just stop. There we go. Actually, I wasted too many shots there. Hold on a minute. We're just, uh, I can do this better. I can do this, you know, cleanly. Now wait for this guy to come close. There we go. Shoot him. Okay, someone survived. Go, Marty. He almost killed me. How much health damage these guys do? Yeah, my god. They're, they do a lot of damage. My god. Anyway, try that again. There we are. Yeah, come on, how much do you have, Jesus Christ? I'm gonna go and shoot your friend over here. There you how did you survive that? Jesus Christ. And you know that those guys are dead. You go and load the shotgun. There we are. You go and grab you. Nice. And you go and destroy you again. There we go. Get everything. There's nothing in those. Just grab the shield. There we are. That's all I can get. In that case, let's leave, right? I got the hell. Yeah, okay, good. That was just a bonus area like I expected, but then this right here is the way we're actually supposed to go. Other than, I don't know what these things are that I just murdered, but I mean, they are definitely some form of enemy that we're supposed to deal with, so, yeah. I don't know. We're gonna probably kill more soon. So, this area, what are we actually supposed to do here? We can definitely jump over here. Never mind, we cannot. Oh, God, yeah. Mm -hmm. Actually, I survived. Fun. What's through here, though? Absolutely nothing at all. Probably should try that again, I should Just so I don't actually kill myself. I was supposed to go through there, I see, but I kind of lost some of my health, so, yeah. Load back in. So, uh, jump onto here, probably this time, there we are. Now, can we go up? Apparently not, I think, yep, yeah, that's definitely exploding. Uh, can I grab onto this wire? Probably, but it's probably going to kill me. Yeah, I can grab onto it, but I just die, yeah. Okay, I see. So, we're definitely supposed to use this wire to get up, but I kind of use it now because it's power. So, I have to find the power switch, disable the power switch, and then you can go and ascend this wire and go to the top. Do these things say anything about that? Um, we are disconnect power before attempting maintenance. Yeah, does it say the same thing here? It does, okay. So what we gotta do is we gotta go and climb that rope and head up towards that elevator. But we cannot do that because the rope is electrified. So you gotta go down, find the power, disable it, then you can go climb up that rope. Makes sense. Probably shouldn't have done that. So that's what we gotta do. We gotta go and uh, disconnect the power from that a wire so you can go and climb the wire. As simple as that. Nope, say that. Mm -hmm. Other than that, we go through into here. You go and climb up here. And go get into here. God damn it. Okay, that is a futile attempt. Okay, get up. There we are, because we're kind of stuck. This little elevator shaft thing. There we go. You go up here. Now you go through here. Nice. But yeah, this area. Girl, might mighty. still falling apart. It's all destroyed. <laughs> That's what you get when you raid a facility, I guess. Right then. So, that says anything useful here. I'm sure you hope so. Uh, kind of like literally nothing here, basically. A nabble of you, but I mean, you empty. Oh, I'm not going to get yet. Mm -hmm, beautiful. Uh -huh, yeah, there's literally no point in destroying those things. Those we're going to destroy. There's some empty room. Why is there so much military stuff stored here? Like, it's not a military facility. It's technically like a private facility, I guess. Authorized personnel only, you know. Oh, God, okay. So, can I actually get through this liquid? That's the thing. Can I go through here? No. So I guess I gotta get for the liquid. I see. Because if I start the liquid, I... What's going on? I do not know what's actually going on. Is my, like, shield falling? Oh, now it is. Very fast. Yeah. Because that is slightly strange. Because the floor is slippy, but, um, 
also damages us sometimes, but only sometimes. I don't think what's going on. Actually, can I head up to that? No, I can't. That's not a bad. Okay. So we're gonna get ourselves through this area, I assume. And we gotta get, get ourselves to the power switch thing, Majiga. So I can disable the power and stop getting electrified non stop. Makes sense. But, um, where is the power switch? I don't know. We gotta pretty go and find it. So how about we really go down here? There we jump over here. Fun. Good. Destroy you. you. Climb up and see what's over here. Pretty big corridor if you ask me. That, on the other hand, looks uh, quite strange. That actually, I think that might be the other side of the, uh, you know, per uh, authorized personal only area. Maybe. I don't know what is through here. It is also one of those things. Yeah, yeah. Can I put this door? No. Oh, I can indeed. Oh, it's the power. Okay, makes sense. Before we turn off the power, I probably want to go over here and just see what is over here. Maybe something useful. Here's something interesting. Oh no, it's just a way to go back. Okay, it's just a quick way to go back to there. I see. Yeah, unit 2 power. Okay, disable that then. Boom. Is it going to turn off all the lights in the area or... Nope. All the lights are still on, so I think all I did is just turn off the power on that, um, big magic. On the elevator allowing us to now ascend the elevator. Fun. Fun, 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 fun. Before we go any further, just got to do one very important thing. And, uh, you know. Huzzah! How did I actually survive? Are these things supposed to be explosive? Oh, not explosive, the RM, just there, yeah. <laughs> anyway, let's uh, go through here, shall we? So, uh, this area, uh, actually, makes sense. where am I going? This area, I actually kind of go back through. The power is off, so it's safe, but I can't go through there anymore. So, we're going to go through up here. There we are, yes, I see. Okay, beautiful. And that's broken. Did I actually... We can actually press the button. But now I can go and send that wire. So now the power has been disabled. I can now actually go up and uh, keep on going for the facility. Yeah, it makes sense, you see. Makes sense. I can go and climb this wire. How do you climb wires again? Um, I know you can jump on it and immediately latches on, but how do you actually go up? It's a very good question. I think we just go and, yep, we just block and point. So we've got to look in the direction we want to go. Or just, yeah, use normal arrow keys. Okay. So we got to go and get ourselves, yeah, swung up. Okay, then. Just get ourselves nicely across. Yeah. Huh, huh, ha, ha. I made it. And that does not look good. Jesus Christ. Somebody definitely died in there. Uh, very brutally, too. What happens if you go under there? Oh, it's just two shields. Nice. I'll definitely have those. Fun, 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 fun. More shield for me. Save the game. Out of there now. Uh, let's first of all do this. Just to see how far we fall. Quite far. Nice. I guess you can do that again, but this time without looking. Just because we're such a badass. There we are. <laughs> and now we're actually going to go keep on going for the game. Head in here. There we are. And see what is here. This is locked. This is very dark in there. Yeah, very dark indeed. Okay, fun. This we cannot really open. That's uh, kind of um, kind of not coming. I'm not going to lie, man. That elevator uh, kind of ain't going to get here anytime soon. Yeah, the wire completely snapped off. God damn it, get out of there. There we are. So we're going to go for here then. That's broken. That's a loading area. Okay. Uh, great. I love loading areas. Just loading the game. Uh, there's different sound effects going on. What is that? Oh, there's water through here. Why is there... How... What? Why is there water leaking out of the vent system? Can I even head into the vent system? Yes, I can. Yeah, of course, that's locked. What is that over there? I don't know. But yeah, we're gonna go and go for the vent system. Is there anything through there? No. Okay, so we're gonna go and push this box over here so we can go and actually get through. Yeah, there we go. Get ourselves through. The thing over there is just the elevator. Yeah, no kidding. Right then, so then we go into... God damn it, into here. Yep, come on. Gonna use the crouch jump thing. Physics area. Yeah, uh-huh. Beautiful. And in we go. God damn it. There we go. Now we're through. Let's see what's here. That's a dead guy. And that's a broken pipe vent thing. My god, but look at that body. That's so ominous. It's just like a dead body flashing at the end of the corridor. That is quite scary indeed. I made a new save, they didn't know me to do that. God damn it, I have two of these. Uh, how do I delete these things? You cannot? That's uh, quite bad. Oh, well, we'll just simply go and override into that save file once we go and make... Um, once we make a new save, basically, we will override that save file because I only want to have like one of these main ones. Oh, I just loaded. God, what have I done? Uh, okay, we can load back into here then. There we are. Then we go and save into here, there yeah. Now we have two save files that aren't auto saves that are of this chapter. We can override one of those when we reach the next chapter, just so we don't have this mess. Yeah. 
makes sense. Anyway, let's keep going. So, that's all broken. Yep. Oh, God. Oh, oh. Hold on. I didn't actually see what happened, which is kind of bad, because I kind of wanted to see what happened. So, you go forward, but then everything explodes. Yeah. And we just fall down here. And now we're just in here. Great. Can I still go there? I definitely can, if I try hard enough, I think. Okay, that's all falling apart. Oh, there's one of those spitter things. God almighty. I gotta kill that thing, like, before it kills me. Yo, dude. Do you want to die and cease living on this mortal plane? Yo, can you, like... Yeah, come here. <laughs> it definitely gets ready to spin inside. It's like, turn the corner. Are you dead? Oh, you're not dead. Ah, stop. There we are. Son of a gun, I hate this thing. Anyways, there's some ammo over here that I'm gonna grab. There we are. Can I get through here? No, it's a dead soldier. But we destroy that bozo, which is good. Now, can I still go through there? Still the dead scientist at the end, but I don't think I can actually head up there. No. So that's the, yeah, that's the broken pipe that we saw emerging for that. Can I, um... Is there a way that I can get up? I don't think there is, because of that thing right there. No. I can get back into here, but that doesn't give us anything. Fine, then I'm gonna go through here. Fun, fun, fun. This is the other side of this. Yeah, it makes sense. I like a push bin. I love pushing bin. Uh, this is actually open. No, what a scam. A fraud. A sham. Can I get up here? Definitely. But the games are gonna let me because plot. Can I go through that? No, because it's locked by an explosive box. But you can now go and open this door. Now, if I was to maybe, uh, I don't know, explode the explosives, would that, that get me through? Apparently not. Maybe we could try again. Yeah, that doesn't work, believe it or not. Okay, fun, so that doesn't work, and that, and yeah, that also doesn't work. But I can't go through here either, so like, um, what? Can I go through there? We came from there. I cannot, ah, oh, I can go in here, I see. Oh, that's, oh, okay, I see, 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 see. Now we gotta go use this box so we can get to get into the vent again. And that's how we can go and get through to uh, that area. And also, like, kind of launch boxes by pressing E. I don't know, it's kind of strange how it works, but, uh, yeah. It's just part of the, like, physics. Now I can go and jump into here, jump into here, and I can go and go to this dead scientist guy. Yo, my man, you for sure are dead, and that's gonna give me a flip an epileptic attack, so probably should leave. And now we're up here, but how does this help us? It literally does not. Okay, so I can go to the top of that thing, which I don't see how that's useful, but yeah, fun, cool, 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 cool. That's just that, that's nothing you know, used to me. So I guess we're supposed to get through here, but I mean, how do you expect me to perform such an action if I can't even get through? Um, I don't know, man. Seems kind of sucks to me. Can I shoot this? No. Can I somehow get through? Kind of like, like, explosion jump. Like, kind of like... Huh! No. It's like, what do you expect me to do then? God damn it. Because I cannot get through here. Determine that much. I cannot get through here, because that's just locks and stuff. That's where I came from. Yep. Mm-hmm. That's going up to there. That I've already searched through, there's nothing else in this area, I can't go anywhere else, that's also locked. I've went into there, there's nothing there, I've went on top of that, there's nothing up there. So, um, now what? I'm never supposed to go, oh I know, I'm supposed to use the, okay, that's idea. I'm supposed to go and use the box. Of course I'm supposed to use the box, what else would I use if not the box? Ah, oh, it's always the box, the box is always the answer. There we are, okay, we're for the same talk. I'm not gonna need to use the box again. That grenade, that is a grenade. A grenade. But yeah, now I gotta go and use the box again to get up to there. Which maybe I don't need to now. She, mm. We need something again in there. I don't know exactly what, but we gotta go and find something. Those doors are locked, like I expect them to be, of course. And like we can, you know. It's not like we can't, oh, you know, force those doors open with our military skills, but yeah, alright. Just pretend that we cannot, you know, stick up the plot. Get into there, of course we can do that, but we can break into here. And there's a trap set directly on the door. That's pretty not too good, but it can break in though. As exposed as that right there. What I'm gonna do then is I'm gonna throw a grenade into here and hope that it's going to do something useful. Will it actually help us? Probably not, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Throw that over there. There we go, grab you again and just hope that you explode. You did indeed, and you blew up half the room with you, my god. Okay. The switch actually still works, oh my god. That's funny. There's a diploma, there's books, there's this like a throne. There's a door that's now definitely open, so I can go and get through. Oh, and well now you can go and take the box through. I see. Man, the developers at Valve really fell in love with this box, didn't they? They're making me use this box for the third time now. Like, literally the third time to complete the game. I don't know I've seen an object in this. Oh, God, what the hell just happened there? But I've never seen a, yeah, I've never seen a box in this game get used for more than one puzzle. We could use it here to get through here. 
and use it again to get into that. Then you have to use it the third time actually to get into that, and I have to go and use it the fourth time. This one little box thing has helped me four times now, and I have a feeling it's gonna help me again another time, probably through that door over there. My god, this is the most useful box in the game. Can I take it with me? Like, to the end of the game? I surely hope so. I doubt it, but well, my hopes are still there. And it's not, no, yeah, now go through here, there we are, no, come on, Mr. Box. Yeah, just get into that, beautiful. That is a headcrab, a blind man could even see that from a distance. Is that the headcrab? Ship him up, there we are. Now what the hell is that thing over there? Cause it, yeah, there we are, oh my god, that guy got, um, electrocuted in a very unfortunate position, you could say. He's somehow on his bed, well, bed, on his desk, still being electrocuted. Uh... Yeah, sorry man, but you appear to be dead. That's a nice chair. I can destroy his books. I can turn off the lights. Yep, okay. Yeah, this guy is definitely dead. Like, look at him. Actually, even I got tasered slightly there. Like, look at this guy. Poor man. Like, look how quickly he drains my shield. Like, if I just touch him. But I actually could still be alive. No, he's dead. Just like me now. But <laughs> let's look at him. The way, like, he shakes his mouth. Oh, it's, it's sad, but it's... Yeah, he's even holding a book. Oh, that is sad. That is generally so sad. Like, look at you, man. <laughs> can I even destroy a body? No, I'm just dead. I can probably somehow destroy his body. Just to stop this pain. Can I? I mean, I can damage it a lot. Um, I don't think I can actually kill him. But I can continue to see him. to make a lot of blood up here. Which still always quite fun, but yeah. And that guy, he's dead. The way he's still being electrocuted. It's sad, but it's quite funny, too. <laughs> Okay, let's keep going. Alright then, what's through here? Any more guys in the kill? Can I open this door? Yes, I can. Right, then. Mr. Box, you're coming with me. I'm gonna go and push you through the very broken physics. Yep, come on then. Mm -hmm. Yep, off you go. Off you go. Come on. Yep, okay, just launch it here, I guess. My god, this box does not cooperate that much, does it? Okay, come on. There we are. Maybe go and push you through here. Maybe go and push you forward. There we are. Oh god, it's a headcrab. I didn't expect that. Huh. Shiv him up. Any more headcrabs on up here? That's a hole in the floor. There's a scientist down there who's still alive. Wow. Interesting. I wonder if there's like a plot to the game. There's the elevator. Oh. What is that? That is a military soldier. Definitely grab that. There's definitely a military soldier that just said something. That looks interesting. That's the elevator over there. Right, I definitely got to go down there. There's someone you're talking about. What, yo, what do you have to say? When you haven't... all the yeah. fighting started, I hid myself here. I don't think any of them above have survived. <laughs> That's slightly unfortunate. Could you say something else? But no. Okay, so he just hit himself you down have here. No idea what is going on? Do you? Uh, I know exactly what's going on. Oh, I didn't actually mean to stab you. I greatly apologize for that, sir. I don't know, I mean to shiv you up right there. That was, um, yeah. Mm, sorry. <laughs> I love it and just see this guy. Oh my god. Okay, now, oh, the headcrab. Yeah, okay, yeah, we understand. You're annoying the headcrab. Grab this box thing. There we are. Let's take it with me to the other room. There we are. Take it further. Take it forward. Oh, that box fell down there. Fine, cool, I guess. But now, can I get past here? Can I get through here? Can I get into here? I don't know, maybe the box would have helped me. Would have some help there. But yeah. Oh, there's definitely a soldier saying something through there, so definitely gotta get to this area. But I mean, oh, I think I'm supposed to use the box, but the box just fell down here. God damn it. Yo. Ah, it's good to see you. Is it? When all the fighting started, I hid myself here. I don't think any of them above have survived. Yeah, they're all dead. Grab this, grab that. I don't know, man. A lot of people could be responsible. Did I need the box? If I needed the box, so best we could go load it in again before I knock the box down here. Go almighty. We have somebody, somebody, you know, saves in here. Such a mess. Oh, then, yeah, yeah, the head crab brings itself at me. I shiver the head crab. I open the doors. There we are. Open the goddamn door. God, the stupid head crab's body. God almighty. Open the door. Oh, my God. It's such a mess. Okay, we load into here. Yes, we see the body. Fun. Head crab comes down. I shiver the head crab. Yep, come here then. Oh, don't, don't land in front of the goddamn door again. Come here. Come here, jump at me. Jump. There we are now. Shiver the head crab. There we are. Head crab's dead. Open the doors. Throw this box. There we are. And I need to go and throw it through there. Beautiful. Push the box. If you take it with us. No, don't send it down there again. Go, Maddie. Send it through here. No, 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 no. God damn it. Ah. Ha, 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 ha. How did you survive that? <laughs> God almighty, okay, so, fun. We go through here, yep. Yeah. Open these doors. God, this is such a mess. I just wanna take the box with me, because I know that I'm gonna need it. Like, I'm most certain I'm gonna need it. Okay, send the box through, this guy comes down, I shiver him up. 
Now we're gonna be careful here. Actually, no matter, we cannot take the box further because of this weird panel thing. So I can go over here. I can have a look at what's going on. I can grab the health, I can break you. But I can't actually take the box because obviously there's no way. But I can throw the box down there, though, so yeah. And this guy's gonna say that he, yeah, 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 yeah. Fun. I don't think any of them above have survived. Yes, they're all dead. You've said that multiple times now. So the game, let me go get through here, open this, or close it even. There we are. There's the power disabled, and I can go and climb up here. Now we're over here. Wow. But Mr. Box, I'm just gonna leave you here. Yeah. So, scientist man, uh, I don't know who you are, and you don't know who I am. But you're kind of stuck down here, and so is my box, so... Yeah, shut up. So I am enlisting you to um, take care of my box, basically. If anything bad happens to my box, something bad well, is going to happen to yeah, you. Money. Yeah, great, cool. So, keep this box safe. You get it? If the box lives, you live. Simple as that. If the box dies, you die too. It's as simple as that. Now that we have made our message to a non-playable character in a video game, we're gonna head up... Oh, that. Oh, we're gonna, gonna head up here. Yeah, yeah, Mr. Box, goodbye. I'll leave you with the scientist. And I gotta go through here. I gotta find out what's going on. Is this the thing that's speaking? I don't think it is. That's the area that he came from. That's just, yeah, where we were a second ago. That's a dead guy. Two dead guys, actually. Man, everybody is dead. Jesus Christ. Oh, well, that's a radio that's doing the speaking. Um, makes sense, really. Grab this. There we are. These guys are just dead. What an unfortunate fate that I have came up. I grab you. There we are. Grab the health. Actually, kind of, what does it say? Oh. What do you mean you're gonna blow them in? Oh! They generally did. <laughs> sure I am. Alright, so now, um... <laughs> so now these two guys are just my friends. We just found two fellow marines who are now with us on this mission. They've also been abandoned. So it's not just us that have been abandoned in this area. It's also been uh, quite a few other soldiers, including these two guys right here. They've also been abandoned. And now we're going to go and escape. So like they said, forget about Freeman. We're going to save ourselves. Yeah, yeah, shut up. So, <laughs> so yeah, those guys I guess are going to be our friends now. So they blew up the maintenance door. My God. This is the elevator. That's locked. Oh, God. That... Well, wow. So we're gonna go through there, that's that. We can go up here, but there's generally nothing up here, so there's no point going up there. What do you mean that is? Oh god, yeah. Great. I just lost two HP. That didn't mean to happen. Okay. No. Yeah. Yeah, shut up. I wanna see what's up here. Uh, I mean I already said there's nothing up there, but we wanna check anyway. Yeah, there's nothing up there, just uh I blind it deep right stuff. So you are just you are just my friends now, eh? Yeah, fun. So this guy right here, this is the um, engineer mechanic guy. He can cut through doors, alright? And this guy is just like some normal soldier. Really He's just a soldier, I don't think he has a special designation. He's just a soldier. <laughs> so you can go through there, we gotta go through here, I guess. Do we? Okay, so I guess I guess we're going up there now. I don't know. I think I'm, I think I'm supposed to make those guys follow me. It's hard to tell where I'm supposed to go and what I'm supposed to do, but yeah. No, I have not. <laughs> Let's see, Roger that. Right, fun. Save the game. Let's see if we can make these guys follow me. Okay, what about you? Okay, they're just with me now. Yep, we just got two buckaroos come with us. Let's go. What happens if I was to um? I don't know. Oh, oh yeah, of course, he's gonna cut through the door. Nice, that's why he grabbed them with us. Okay, so he's just, yeah. Alright, well, then. He's gonna go PS through the elevator door. Fun. Fun, fun, fun. Yeah, 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 yeah. okay, we get it. It's so cool we got friends, though. I mean, I shouldn't call them friends. They're comrades. Allies. Yeah. Anyway, the door's down. We can now get through, can't we? Yeah, we can indeed. <laughs> <laughs> he just kicks the door down. My god. <laughs> He'll buy the whole damn bar. Wow. So fun, so this guy's our friend now. But what happens if I was to shoot him before he cut through the door, huh? I wanna know that. So we're gonna go and save the game right here. I'm gonna load into this auto save before uh, he cut through the door. 
And now I'm actually gonna go and actually kind of open this now. No, okay. So we're gonna go and firstly wait for him. We gotta speak to the radio, and then we're gonna open the door. Yep. They blew the maintenance door. There we are. Now what am I supposed to shoot this guy in the head? Oh, they just die and... Subject Corporal Shepard, status evaluation declined, post-mortem. Subject felt effectively utilized human assets in achievement of goal. I see, supposed to, I was supposed to keep these guys alive. If I kill them, then well, we fail. I don't know why they exploded when they died, but yeah, they did. Anyway, so now I guess we're piling this elevator, come on. Yeah, come on then, come to the elevator. Come with me. God damn it, come with me. Go. You only go, mate. Like, yeah, go. Yeah, I know you do. Go. No, you come with me. Yeah, you coming? You're coming. Now come with me through here, because I kind of need you. Yeah, I know it's looking pretty grim. Can I make you come with me? I probably need this guy. But I mean, I don't think I need this guy, but I want to make him come with me too. Hey, come on, dude. Okay, you're just bugging out. My God, mate. But actually, I mean, you're trying to follow me. But you're doing a very bad job at it. Oh. Come on, then. Can I make you go for this door? Like, he's just not going to go for this door. No matter what I try. Like, come on. Mate, dude, come on. What do, what do you want me to do? Go, I kind of push you around so, like, go for the goddamn door, mate. Off the love, God. What happens if I was to just, you know... Nothing. I can just kill him. Nothing happens. Hold on. So, yeah, I'm supposed to. I'll just kill you, too. Okay. So I can kill both of them, but nothing happens. Okay, great. Fun. Amazing. Cool, 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 cool. <laughs> I just shoot the guy. Anyway, um, I guess we're going to go and finish off here. I don't know how to get this guy to go for the door. I'll have to figure that out in the next episode. But for now, ladies and gentlemen, we have indeed run out of time. Therefore, we're going to finish off right here. We had a pretty good episode. We kept on going through, obviously, Black Mesa. We went past... That, um, that area, we killed some of those weird things, you climbed up the elevator, and we also found two soldiers who have also been left behind in Black Mesa, meaning that we're no longer alone. We now got two allies by our side, which are gonna help us with this mission, which is quite good. So yeah, I gotta say it is a pretty good episode. What does this say? No. Nothing else, alright. But yeah. It was a pretty good episode, and yeah, it was fun. But ladies and gentlemen, we're going to finish up right here, because we have indeed run out of time. So, yeah, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. We're in the next episode. Me and these two bros are going to keep going through Black Mesa in attempt to escape. That'll be the next episode. For now, thank you for watching, and goodbye!